To treat asthma, you may need a rescue inhaler to relieve attacks quickly. A commonly used rescue inhaler is albuterol. Here's what you need to know if you've been prescribed this medication. During an asthma attack, the airways become inflamed and swollen. The swelling narrows the airways, which causes wheezing and shortness of breath. Albuterol is a type of medication called a short-acting beta agonist. This class of medication works by relaxing the muscles around the airways. This opens them up so you can breathe more easily. You'll take one or two puffs of your albuterol rescue inhaler at a time to treat an asthma attack, depending on what your healthcare provider prescribes. You should start feeling better within minutes. You can use it every four to six hours as needed. Talk to your doctor if you're needing it frequently. This may be a sign that you need to adjust your treatment plan. You might also be prescribed albuterol to prevent exercise-induced asthma. Your prescriber will give you instructions for how to use your inhaler for this purpose. Your prescriber is the person who wrote you the prescription. This may be your primary care doctor, nurse practitioner, physician's assistant, or a specialist like a pulmonologist. They'll work with you and your pharmacist to form your care team. Your prescriber knows your health history, so they know how the medication will help meet your treatment goals and how it might affect other parts of your health. Both your pharmacist and prescriber can answer questions about how to take albuterol. In general, hold the inhaler upright, shake it well for five seconds, and then remove the mouthpiece cover. Breathe out fully, then close your lips around the mouthpiece. Press down on the top of the inhaler to release the medication, and breathe in deeply and slowly as you do so. Then hold your breath for 10 seconds, or as long as it's comfortable for you. Release the top of the inhaler, and then breathe out slowly for as long as you can. Shake the inhaler again, wait one minute, then repeat for your second puff. If it's your first time using the inhaler, or you haven't used it in a couple weeks, you will need to prime your inhaler. Hold it away from your face and spray the medication two or four times. Then it's ready to use. Both your prescriber and your pharmacist can answer your questions about side effects, which may include a sore throat, headache, and runny nose. Don't be afraid to ask your pharmacist or provider about affordability. These days, there are many low-cost ways to get your medication.